One of our featured fights, Zach Malazny versus Jiao Miao. Looking forward to this fight all night. Yeah, me too, Nick. This is one that I really wanted to see. Jiao Miao. Ladies and gentlemen, we continue with our super fights. Live on USC Fight Pass. This match, six minutes. Submission or draw, 140 pound weight limit. First, out of 10th Planet Bethlehem. Step forward, please, Zach Maslany. Across the map from Unity BJJ, here is Joao Miao. Joao Miao here on the rise stage, one of the most decorated Brazilian jiu-jitsu competitors of all time. Zach Maslany is a rise veteran, but I think he's facing the biggest challenge of his career against Miao, who immediately sits to guard and tries to work the De La Riva. The, the Miao brothers do nothing but train day in and day out, and they train hard. Now Miao looking to get the control on the inside of the leg. Zach Maslany tries to die for Miao's head, but the Miao brothers have some of the most legendary, unpassable guards that you'll see anywhere. Now a straight foot lock, and he just locks it up. Zach Maslany is rolling. That was tight. That was a straight foot lock, Nick. Mm -hmm. Zach did a great job just rolling out, identifying it, and reacting to it. But now he's, just like you were saying before, he put himself into that leg lock position, and uh, they reset in the middle. Joao Miao is cutting such a frenetic pace that it's hard to keep up with everything he's doing. Now he's got De La Hiva hook. Zach Maslany is controlling the other leg. But that's really not going to stop the Baron Bolo. In fact, it may even help it. And he used it to expose the free leg and go for a leg lock of his own. And we out again using that left arm to control the ankle and the heel of Zach. And that's typically used to, to control for a De La Hiva guard, which he goes to again. Right, and you saw Zach, you know, kind of overhooking both of the ankles there to, to nullify the attack of Joao Miao there. Now, Joao comes on top. The Miao brothers have been working their passing a lot lately in competition, and they're really good at it. They're known for their guards, but their passing is just such high pressure. You wonder if that's credited to their work with Marilla Santana. For sure. At Unity BJJ, a you know, legendary pressure guard passer in his own right. And here he goes driving great, great pressure from that top position. Joao Miao just closed out the division with his brother at the most recent IBJJF World Championships. So this is the, the, the reigning world champion in the gi right now for this weight class. And now he has that smash position with the legs and he's just putting so much pressure on Zach. And Zach can think about going for a leg lock here, yeah. but the Meow brothers never tap to leg yeah, locks. I've I, seen them in some bad spots. Yeah, there's a... Uh, I've seen Gary Tonin put put them in, in just these brutal heel hooks. And now he's, Joao is going for one of his own. Kind of a toe hold. They're not afraid to go for those leg locks themselves. Joao's using that to turn Zach back towards the center of the mat. And referee Dave Patton says, thank you very much. Zach doing a great job defending there. And he saw uh, Joao there. He was holding his, holding his big toe up against his chest there. And it, it, it stops Zach from rolling the opposite direction. Just shows, shows the experience there, going for another toe hold. Yeah. Better position. Oh, no, he doesn't have that same leg control. Zach's other leg in there is buying him a little bit of space, but there's still a lot of pressure, and it's forcing yeah, Zach so see to how roll. See how he's pulling that toe, his big toe towards his, his chest there? Yes. It stops Zach from turning to the direction that he wants. He, he can't turn left, right? What, what then, a, yeah. What, now he's what, attacking the heel. Yeah, what a small detail that controls oh, so yes. much of the body. Yes, now he has that inside. I don't I can't tell what, what leg he has there. I'm not sure he has the heel. Zach going for his own. Yeah, but it's almost <laughs> crossing, <laughs> uncrossing. Joao has a better position right now. I think he may just abandon the legs. Yeah, he, he's trying to get up higher above the above the knee line so that he can he can keep those legs inside. You see Zach doing an, an amazing job uh, defending Joao's 
attacks here. You know, Zach is very experienced in, in the leg yeah. lock game as yep. well. Yep. Now that's a good grip for the heel hook. You see good Zach position. grabbing that foot, right? So that's an unorthodox way to, to defend the heel hook there and a uh, smart defense, I might add. He doubles up on the grip now. And, and there's the tap. Joel Miao is successful in his rise debut. He finishes with the heel hook. What a performance. He was in control pretty much that whole time, Nick. That, that's, that is elite level grappling. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout was stopped at the 128 mark. Winner by submission by way of a heel hook. Yow, meow, out.